I came from that way, <coughs> all the way from Bedford, and now I'm eventually going to wind up in Concord Center. Ah, oh, here we go. This is where I'll rejoin the Reformatory Branch Trail not too far south of where I left it. And I think I did actually come in on this thing last year. So this is what happens with aging and senescence. <laughs> It is a great trail. Oh, there's that squawking heron again. This is probably one of the Main spots of parting. Definitely didn't <coughs> cover this part of the edge trail in my last visit. Probably. bring us to the observation tower. Dream residence for something. Oh, 
Yeah, here we are at the principal trail entrance and parking lot. We'll do another minor diversion. Maybe I'll <coughs> test the long lens. It's pretty busy for a sleepy Thursday. <coughs> and the cool thing is, what with the prohibitions against pooches and bicycles and whatnot, it lets you know that the people who do come here are mostly interested in the living world. That was more iris. Wow, quite a profusion. everywhere. Well, the observation tower appears to be relatively unattended. <laughs> that trail has been closed. Ah, and there's an accommodating bike rack. Sunrise to sunset. this rig set up, testing its efficacy. Oh, there goes another heron. And the overhead roar of air traffic gives way to the more plebeian hum of landscapers 
blowers. May as well get a bit of down the stairs we go. Don't hang out here when there's lightning out. In case you may not have noticed, the thing's made of metal. And it's also slippery when it's soaking wet. The things they have to tell people these days, I tell you. This is probably a busy warbler hangout a week or two ago. You can hear the yellow throats in there somewhere. So now, we'll work our way towards downtown Concord. <laughs> 